Your hands are older than you think. Thousands of years ago, dancers in India used hand gestures called mudras to tell stories of gods and heroes. Today, those same gestures might control your VR games. Let me explain. In Chennai, engineers taught AI to understand Indian sign language with 99.4% accuracy, almost perfect. Now think, what if your grandma's yoga mudras could swipe through TikTok? Startups are trying exactly that. One company, ImmersiveX, is testing gloves that let gamers feel virtual objects using ancient pressure point. Imagine grabbing a digital sword and actually sensing its weight. But here's the weird part. Why is Meta spending millions on haptic gloves that use air bubbles to mimic touch? Could they be inspired by something older? Look at Kathakali dancers. Their 24 mudras have specific meanings. Coincidence? Maybe. But in labs, engineers are racing to map these gestures to VR commands. And get this, India's 7.5 million deaf citizens use hand signs so detailed they're teaching robots to communicate. A student in Mumbai built an app that turns sign language into text instantly. What if one day your VR avatar could talk using 2,000-year-old mudras? But wait, why is this happening now? Simple, your hands don't need buttons. Scroll your phone, that's a mudra. Zoom a map, another mudra. We're going back to the future, friends. If you're still watching, you get it. This isn't just tech, it's about us. How India's past is quietly shaping the world's next big leap. Want to see how a temple dancer's gesture could unlock Apple's next headset? Hit subscribe. We're just getting started.